Hey, what's up guys? I uh, just wanted to show you real quick how is it that I mask the canopies. Now, and this canopy is 148 scale, so it's quite large, uh, which is easier to mask uh, canopies like that. Um, what are you gonna need? It's a brand new blade. Uh, I have a number 11 blade here in my X-Acto knife. I like this knife because it's a, it's a big handle. I have big hands and um, you know, that way it could be more st steady or, you know, you don't slip. Um, so that's why I like this knife. Um, you're gonna need a brand new knife. And then what I did is I like to use, oops, I like to use, um, you know, 40 mil to me a tape. That way I only use one piece instead of just cutting um, a lot of pieces and, and, and making it like that. Um, but you can use any tape you want. I, I just like Tamiya because it's uh, it's very very durable and it doesn't lift off after after a while, you know. So you guys can see here, I have it all messed up. Uh, I just need to cut it. Now I've talked before about using your phone. This is a good um, good tip that I learned from. Uh, from Phil Flory, um, I don't think he uses it, but he mentions it. It's just an idea um, where you could use your phone, and if you have, say, a screen that it's bright enough, you could use that, place the canopy on top, and cut it. Use the light underneath. To give you an idea, let me let me turn all the lights here. And you can see, you can see how it, how it works. Another thing you could do is actually take a picture of something bright. For example, the light, which I have here. See that? That's the light. Now you gotta take it before it focuses. That way it's just bright. And then you could just, if you have a smartphone or an iPhone, you could just zoom it and blam, you have it. And you could see, you could see through the tape. You know, I think far away it looks better. But you could see through the tape. And another thing is, I was thinking, and I don't know on Android if they have this app, but there's an app called Flashlight. You turn it on, and you have a light. Place it underneath, and it's really, really bright. Now you can really see where you're cutting. And it works, guys. It's a very, very useful tip. Um, I just thought about that because I was like, well, I need an, a bright light so I could see through the, through the, you know, through the light. So for this kind of canopies, you know, for the front of the canopy where there's a lot of curves and stuff, this works really, really good. I mean, it just plays it on top there and cut away so I'm gonna do that and then I'll show you guys the result but it's a really nice tip to to cut canopies okay see you on the nice bit all right so I'm about to do this one um, you guys can see I don't know if the camera picks it up it's probably too bright for the camera but I can see clearly the outline of where I need to cut so the reason why this is a good idea is because it's easier to maneuver you know it's easier to just hold it on the air while you're cutting this gives you a little bit of support so you just hold it down and then with the tip of your blade very very carefully and you don't want to um, you know push in too much you don't want to use a lot of force that's why your blade has to be new and very very sharp okay
Okay. Now we're just gonna peel. You guys could see that it really, really works. And like I said, this is just an idea, a little tip. If you have your own way, by all means, by all means, use it. Um, but this, this is a nice tip that I learned. And then I just uh, thought about using the uh, the LED underneath, and voila. It gives you a nice edge and like I said you could go back with the strips of tape you know and kind of resharpen everything and remodify it you can use a toothpick to kind of stretch the edges out make sure that they're nice and round you know where they need to be round but uh, yeah it's a really nice quick tip using your iPhone or your smartphone or whatever phone you have that has an LED you can use that place it on top and use that as a light okay there's the other one nice and it saves a lot of time guys um, instead of you know just um, you know holding the, the the piece to the light and trying to cut this gives you a little bit of support. Uh, there was times that I, you know, I had to lift my hand up and and just uh, use it like that. But um, other than that, it's a really nice, quick tip to to do master canopy. So, hope you guys found this helpful, and thank you for watching. Bye bye.